This module will demonstrate how to export a mapping specification into Power Center as a map. For the purpose of this exercise, we will create a mapping specification within the Analyst tool and then export it to Power Center repository as a mapping and view the mapping within Power Center using the designer. For the purpose of this demo, we will be using the version 951 Hotfix 3. Now to demonstrate the process. As you can see, we have logged into the Analyst tool. And within the project demo, we have two data objects, EMP1 and EMP1 TGT. These are the objects we will be using to create our mapping specification with. So first, let us create a mapping specification. So let us choose the Actions drop-down and select New and select the option Mapping Specification. So now this comes up with the first screen where we have to give a name. Let us just call it MS Demo. Sorry, MS Demo. Click Next. We need to add a source, so we click on the plus sign and select the project demo, select EMP1 as the source, click OK and click Next. We will not be using a virtual target, we have to specify a target, so we again go to the project demo, select EMP1 TGT as a target and click Finish. So now we can see the bare bones of the mapping specification. We can see the sources over here and the target columns over here. So now let us map the columns from the source to the target. Let us select the column ID from EMP1 and select Employee ID and map to the column. And likewise, select the name select the last name and map this to the column. We can add any more transformations that we would like, for example, uh, a filter or um, uh, or a rule uh, and or an expression transformation over here, but for the purpose of this demonstration, we are just going to be using uh, a straight map from the source to the target. Now that this map has been created, we can export this. So we select Actions and select Export. We select the option for Power Center, click Next. We explicitly choose the target that was used in the mapping specification and select Next. Now here we have the option of exporting this mapping specification to an XML file. This XML file will be of the format that can be imported into a Power Center repository. Or you can directly export this to a Power Center repository. We choose the version 9.5.1. We have the host name where the repository is running, uh, the port number, the username that is administrator, and we enter the password for this. And you have to specify the security domain and the repository where you would be exporting this to. Once you click Next, it will establish connection to the repository and it will show you the list of folders that are available. So for the sake of a demo, we shall use the demo folder within the Power Center repository and click Finish. Once the export is complete, you will see this pop up message in the Analyst tool. And you can close this. Now we will look at the map or maplet that was exported within the Power Center designer. So here we have logged into the repository using the Power Center Designer and opened the folder demo. This was the folder into which the mapping specification was exported. 
and if we open the map we can see that the map consists of the uh, of a maplet and the target and if we were to open the maplet you can see the source exists and you have a transformation which leads it to the output transformation you can modify this um, map and the maplet further for your business requirements but the purpose of this is to really show how the uh, mapping specification can be exported to power center as a power center map as always your feedback is welcome you can send your feedback by email to support videos at informatica.com or via twitter to twitter.com slash infrasupport and this concludes this module